So, as I have done a couple times before, I have uh, taken Ramon from behind the camera, my director, videographer, uh, extraordinaire, and uh, he's been doing something really weird. So I said, I want to find out why you're doing this, what are you doing, and tell everybody how you're doing it. So number one, since we filmed the last time, you got rid of your car. We're in LA, Los Angeles. Okay, get that, people. Number two, you have gone on a healthy lifestyle binge with, I think you were carrying a green smoothie in when I saw you, and you are somehow making all these changes. So I want to know from you, how can, how is it even possible that you're making all these changes and then you're sticking to them and other people have all these ideas and they want to make a change and they never get to it. So what is he doing that we should know about so we can make changes as easily as he? Or is it not that easy? <laughs> well, it's the, once I commit to the decision um, and I actually start doing something, it actually becomes really easy. But um, I, like a lot of people, um, anguish in you know, the mental struggle before that <laughs> for what seems like an infinite amount of time. Um, but a lot of these things um, are all the same when you kind of induce action. Mm -hmm. um, the next step after the first step is easier and the third step is easier. And, um, and you know it's cliche, but you have to do it. You have to really like actually do it for it to be easier like for change. Now for me, like, you know, being healthy um, is kind of more of like a return for me than like a drastic life change. I just took a few years off. <laughs> you took time off of being healthy. <laughs> Unfortunately. Uh, yeah, I felt like I was like reliving my freshman 15, <laughs> but it turned into like a freshman 25, <laughs> much older. Um, but uh, as far as like my car, um, yeah, it's LA. Uh, I decided to get rid of my car um, as a, a working uh, videographer and uh, independent filmmaker. Um, there were some choices that I wanted yeah. to make. For me, it wasn't about the money so much as it was about the time. And the less money I had in my overhead, the um, less time I needed to spend working on jobs that weren't going in a direction that I wanted to go in. So now I'm able to be more selective. Mm -hmm. I'm able to work on um, jobs that are more synonymous with my mindset. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and to me, that was the most important thing. Uh, it wasn't just about the money. So I was really re like reducing uh, my expenditures. And then the health kind of got kick-started because eating unhealthy a lot of times means fast food and a lot of times fast food adds up you don't think it does you think those two um tacos from jack in the box for a dollar 19 they used to be 99 cents but they're like, they're like a dollar <laughs> 29 now or whatever you think those like if that's all you ate it'd be cheap but you don't you don't you always get the curly fries and then you get a coke and then you get all the stuff and then by the end of the week if you've eaten fast food so much like i was i was working crazy hours um, I was spending tons of money every week on fast mm -hmm. food. So I was like, I need to cook so I can save some money. And, uh, and cooking suddenly I was like, why? I, I can cook for the same price, something healthy that still tastes good. Amelia Earhart says, coming to the decision is the hard part. The rest is merely execution. Um, so it's really an execution problem once you've made up your mind and then, you know, just kind of sticking with it, number one and number two. I like that you said that you're willing for the long-term benefit, uh, for the del you are willing to do delayed gratification, which is actually a real epidemic, I think, in America, that we need our satisfaction now and today. We cannot delay it. So you, you just said, you know, for the greater go goal, somewhere down the road, I'm setting, uh, I'm delaying my gratification right now because I know that it'll bring me to a bigger goal. So here you hear it straight from Ramon. A changes are possible. Just uh, make sure. You do it for the right reasons, and then you get your head really straight and committed, and then execution seems to be just like that. Thanks for watching, guys.